Hello and welcome to a Project Cars 2 video where today we're going to be doing some rallycross racing against AI. We're going to be starting in fifth position driving the Ford Focus WRX, specifically the Ken Block livery Ford Focus. And we're going to be at Knockhill Rallycross. This is a setup that I'm using. It is basically just the default rallycross setup, but the only change that I've made is dropping SIP gear down to 0.0. 964 rather than the 1.0 whatever it was uh, previously it just helps a little bit going down the start finish straight just quickly before i start the ai strength setting is set to 110 percent and then their aggression setting is set to 80 so let's get into it let's get on the grid let's get first gear engaged hold the handbrake wait and build the revs ready for the green light which is there launch the car off the line and i've just got absolutely swamped by the AI who are much better off the line than myself there. Just didn't quite time the release of the handbrake quite right. Now we come into turn two, so we drop down the hill from the usual circuit and then we hook a right and come through this infield section going through all the dirt and the gravel here between the bankings. You can see just all the stones and everything being flicked up by the cars in front. Effectively shortcutting the main track before rejoining again for the last couple of corners. Someone in the rear view mirror there just going and taking the joker lap. So we're now up into fourth position at the end of that first lap. Let's see what we can do with the cars in front. Obviously we've got a Honda Civic here directly in front of us. Hooking up the tarmac on the inside of that hairpin quite nicely. This is great fun really having to work the wheel here. Feed the car through this section. AI a little bit slow there but managed to nip up the inside of the Civic. So now it's this Volkswagen Polo. car getting very sideways there as we're trying to get through turn two. You need to watch out for those big tyre stacks that are here on the right hand side. It's hitting those will damage the car quite badly as the polo goes and clips that, uh, that banking on the outside there. Oh they're going for the joker lap. I've gone way too deep. Got a bit of a run on this Renault. Let's see if we can pass them before the first corner. Looks like we've managed to do that. Picked up turn two very nicely that time. It's so nice to run through here without all the stones and dirt and gravel being flipped up in my face. These cars sound absolutely mental. Right, let's do a stroke lap. Let's do it now. Deep caught the gravel there as well. Oh, through the chicane. Oh, this is close. Very close with the other cars. Looks like we managed to get P4 though before the straight, which is good. those tyre walls. And we're going to come out in relation to the other guys with the Joker. Looks like P2 overall. There's someone who needs to do the Joker on the final lap. Who is up ahead. That's a little bit wide and a little bit deep there. So this is Nat P1 that's here in front of me. Let's see if we can get him before the end of the lap. I think it's going to be pretty difficult though. Oh, clipping the wall. No! Lost that drag race. Oh man. 
P3 in the end. What a race that was. Just to let you know, I did turn off the track limits penalties because they are quite tight on this circuit and it's a lot more enjoyable and kind of a bit more true to uh, the nature of Rallycross with them off. Just makes it a little bit more exciting. You can push the limits a little bit more. But hopefully you guys enjoyed that video with that Rallycross racing. Very much action-packed. Very, very fun indeed. Thoroughly enjoyed that one myself. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. But hopefully I shall catch you in the next video. Until then, have fun, stay safe, and take care.